Hey, what's up, people of the world and beyond? Um, I decided to do a vlog today um, because there's a lot of stuff that's going on right now, or not a lot, but uh, stuff has changed that I felt like I should probably put out there. Well, first things first, uh, a while back I got glasses. Um, I'm just not wearing them because, as you can probably tell, there's a lot of reflection with them. So at the moment, I'm just not going to wear them. They're actually two different prescriptions, I guess, or something, because there's distance that I have problems with, as well as stuff that's uh, pretty close up. So there's that. So otherwise, um, the most recent thing was that I was broken up with uh, pretty recently. Um, it's allowed me to reflect on a few things about myself as well as my life that um, we were just not seeing eye to eye and stuff. There was um, stuff for our futures that aren't going to line up very well. So I can understand that and I'm not bitter. I'm not devastated. Uh, it's something that, you know, I, I kind of have to, like I said, reflect on and maybe either change how I act and how I perceive things as well as what I take in from life itself. Moving on to that, um, you know, what I really haven't taken into account in life up until recently is um, not necessarily empathy, but empathy as well as how to perceive the world and how to perceive life. Up until this point, I, I think I've taken it in strides where I, I, because I haven't had the trust in people, uh, I therefore don't like people. I mean, I don't really like people regardless. Um, but I think what I have to do instead is not really necessarily care about what other people believe about me and how I am treated in that sense, but more so how I treat them and how I treat myself. So with that in mind, I think the main thing to focus on, at least in life, is to just enjoy what you have and uh, what you have going for you and what is ahead and what you can be hopeful for. Essentially what my policy on life is, you know, if you're not, if you're not going to uh, basically kill yourself, if you're not going to, to do something sacrificial like that um, and, and completely selfish in that sense, then just enjoy life for what it is, for what you have. I mean, obviously do what you want that makes you happy, um, but to an extent you can't do everything that makes you happy. That's just how life is. And life is not fair in that sense, you know, and, and um, you're not going to be spoon fed what everything that you want, you know, what you want in life. You got to you got to earn it. You got to take it for yourself and um, but not take it for granted. You know, there's there's you know, everybody has, I think, a different policy on what what they want with their life or rather what how how they perceive their own lives and what to do with that. Um, and it, like I said, it varies depending on, you know, person to person on what they want. And um, I think with me, that whole perception where I just got to enjoy life and not take things so seriously and stuff, it's going to take a while for me to get used to that. You know, I, up until this point, I think I've taken too much out on myself. I've, I've been too hard on myself and therefore I've been hard on others. Um, I think I've taken too much, not for granted, but for what it's worth. Um, I've taken in too much... Uh, as if there's negativity, as if there's hatred from other people and analyzed it like that and analyzed people like that. Um, therefore, I act like that. So from here on out, I, I want to try and get into that new policy where I, I don't believe in that. You know, I, I don't actually believe that everybody's out to get me. Everybody hates me. It's more so that it's been a vicious circle for most of my life where I've had a negative, uh, you know, attitude in most of my life. Therefore, people treat me badly. Therefore, I have a negative attitude. So it's like chicken or the egg in that sense. Um, I don't know which which came first or or how, um, you know, to progress with it. You know, if if I'm treated badly, should I be, you know, bad to them? No, I shouldn't. But should I treat bad or treat myself badly afterwards? No, I shouldn't. Am I going to? Probably. Um, it's more so, like I said, that I, I want to try and be better to myself and, and take things a little bit more positively, be a little more hopeful, hopeful. And if I continue to do that, then hopefully, you know, everything will work out.
pretty well for me for years and years to come. So at this point, I'm still trying to find a job or jobs or internships, paid internships in my field. Um, if you have anything, if you know anybody that would like to have a videographer, video editor, director, writer, et cetera, of anything video or even photography related, um, just let me know, basically. Other than weddings, I'm pretty much open to any uh, concepts. I want, I want to be more creative about it. I don't want to just shoot video for the sake of shooting video um, if I can avoid it. But at this point, I don't think I can. So if you have anything that... Um, you know a person that know, that needs something video wise then just uh, that's that's exactly what I um, am trying to do in my field at this point I guess I'm more so confused about how to start um, I know there's two different directions that I can go in in this industry one is I can do everything independently at this point because YouTube is so big I could probably get to a point where at least I'm getting some views from it but otherwise um, I feel like it's it's either hit or miss with that um, but otherwise, trying to do everything independently, do contract work, um, build up a repertoire strictly, you know, solely, you know, just on my own um, as an individual, not through a company. The other way to do it is to go through a company, um, get your bearings, get you know, get my bearings, get my ground uh, in the in the field, in the um, in the industry, and then from there, with the career path, I can do independent work and then do whatever I want. Um, either way, at some point or another, it probably will, will clash. You know, I'll be able to do independent work as um, part of my career if I start in a company. And then if I wanted to, as an independent contractor, I could also hop on, I could also hop on to production work in either one certain company or, you know, go into different companies. As I said, like right now, I, I have no idea where I should start. You know, I, I've tried to put pieces together as to how to form like a business um, for myself to make stuff either for myself or for others. I just don't know how to go about doing that um, logically and appropriately and professionally. If anybody has any advice, definitely uh, hit me up. As far as videos are concerned for myself, I am going to start a new series. Um, it's basically going to be a sort of a critique um, as to overall things. It's normally it's it's going to normally be about movie series, TV series, video games, or sometimes comic books or something else that's creative, um, or like a book or even even authors, you know, um, I don't know something along those lines where it's going to be I'm going to critique this uh, one specific aspect um, for that series or, or media um, that I think is is uh, needing. Uh, improvement in in different places. For example, I think the first one I'm going to do is going to be about the Marvel Cinematic Universe, um, and you'll you'll probably see it. I'm probably going to shoot it today, so you'll 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 get to see it. Otherwise, if you have suggestions as to something like that, like if there's a video game series and you really like it, but there's something wrong with it that you think they could do a whole lot better with, and then if they do it later on, if they make another one, then what could they do differently? Um, or if there's like a movie franchise that you don't want to see rebooted and here's the reasons why, if there's something like that that you want me to do, just let me know. And I am very good at ranting at a camera, so I will, I will definitely get on it. Otherwise, with that series ahead that I think I'm going to do pretty well at because I, I can combine this sort of um, style of just uh, face to camera with uh, graphics and animation and stuff like that. Um, I'm also going to hopefully do some drumming and singing work very, very soon. I have a couple of ideas. My main idea uh, for singing and drumming right now is going to be taking an old playlist from an old band that I was in called The Rising Action and redoing it, or rather covering all those songs with drumming and singing included. I'm also probably going to be doing another cover from uh, the band Issues from their latest album from last year, Headspace. I did one, if you wanna go check that out. Um, I did Hero. I'm probably going to do maybe one or two other songs. Um, in the past, I've done a format where I'll do a cover of a song or whatever, like a, one video, and then I'll link a bonus video in the description of that video that's unlisted. So that way, the only way that you get to it is through that description of that video. It's kind of like a gimmicky type thing, but at least it'll get 
you guys interested in possibly seeing other covers if you are interested in that kind of content. Otherwise, um, I did Let's Plays for a long time. I don't know if I'm gonna go back to it only because even though it is fairly easy to do because of the PS4's uh, video recording capabilities, it's not really something that I want to do because it's not creative. It's more so something that if I wanted to do it every once in a while, maybe I'll do it because you know while I'm playing a game, if I think, wow, this is really cool, I wanna film it, I'll do that. But otherwise, it's not something that I want to keep doing only because, like I said, it's not creative. It's not something that I can put my heart and soul into. It's more so just, okay, I'm going to I'm gonna put this you know, certain amount of effort into it and only get zero views <laughs> over the course of six months. Because at this point, that's basically what it is. I would rather be devoted to making a video such as this, such as, like I said, the new series that's coming out or, or a singing video where I'm putting actual thorough effort into it and regardless of the views, I'll feel like I've done more to it, therefore possibly more outcome. All right, I think that's it. Um, like I said, if you have any job possibilities or anything like that, let me know. If you have any interests in giving me ideas for that new series, um, definitely let me know. And if there's any singing or drumming that you think would be um, awesome to see a, a, a guy do that has a decent vocal range that has actually no expertise at all whatsoever in singing, then uh, definitely let me know that too. Otherwise, I'll see you in the next video. See you later.